I am so excited to see Westwood keep coming out with these fabulous instruments. This is the electric home piano from Westwood. I think only about 70 of these were made and it looks kind of like a Rhodes in a beautiful um, cabinet. Let's just dive in. I love this new layout. It just comes with one NKI and that's what we've loaded and that gives us access to everything. And the first thing that I usually do, <laughs> the first thing I usually do is I go find where the pedal noises are and I just kind of turn those down a little bit. Now we're gonna settle in here. And this is just the basic um, first electric piano patch. And it's just got such a nice tone. So I'm just gonna, let's just get into it. That's what I love about the SL88 is that um, it can really get into those softest of dynamic layers. And if an instrument has those, it'll go find them. And that's where some beauty comes on. BF, good to see you. Welcome. dig into it and get into that get into that stuff and back it back down listen to how soft you can get this I'm just going to play soft and then just gradually just build it up I loved when I got up here, you got the, uh, it almost sounds like a, um, a glockenspiel. It's got that delicate bell sound.
Yeah, and that's just the um, <laughs> that's just the electric piano. That's just the first sound source, and that's uh, incredible, uh, incredible. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's my. Okay, let's just reset this. That's one of the. I'm having um, window capture issues. I'm just trying to adjust the um, adjust the um, microphone. Yeah, and it, okay, that's it, Cade. Yeah. Celeste, it's uh, Celeste. Um. Yeah, very cool. And we've got uh, different controls for uh, expression, dynamic range, and then the texture volume. And this is amazing. Let's just turn off some of these um, some of these mics and go. Let's turn on the cassette. I'm really curious about what this cassette. Um, uh, well, the tape. Yeah, I'm real curious what the tape sounds like. So let's just turn the tape up a little bit. Now this is captured directly from the built-in cassette recorder you saw on the website on the inside of this piano, uh, which I think is kind of cool. Um, So you get a really wild saturation. It just kind of crushes it a little bit. And then we've got uh, reverb that we can, got a little studio reverb there. Yeah, Adrian, it's got, uh, it's just got a little personality that just kind of comes through with that. Um, let's go ahead and go through some of the snapshots and explore some of these um, a little bit. So, oh, you, yeah, you know what? Let's just, I think these basically just kind of take you through um, some of these, yeah. Okay, let's go to the muted bars. Um, Now I'm going to bump up, um, let's see something here. Okay, so if we um, bring this dynamic down a little bit, I was going to increase the velocity, uh, coming out of the keyboard just to get into that but I think we can just drop this down that's fun okay <laughs> wow And again, you have a personality down here on this end of the keyboard, and then another personality comes out up here at top. You've got really a really fat sound. And then you come up here, and it's it's bright and cheery. And in the middle, it's kind of like a marriage of, of both together. Yeah, so it's got so much personality stretched out across the keyboard. Um, and then we've got the soft tone bars. <laughs> okay, let's see, make sure. Yeah, let's go to the preset uh, soft tone bars and make sure we've got that going. so cool and then we look over here 
And then we've got effects that we can um, we can just shift, shift do, do some tonal shifts, uh, some delays uh, and stereo wideners. And so uh, Rob or Adrian, uh, I saw this uh, trans pitch setting here. Can you can you kind of maybe give me a I mean, I mean, I should have read the manual, uh, but can you kind of tell us what this does? And we can explore that. Uh, we can explore that a little bit. And um, let's just keep going into some more of these um, dry mixes. Let's do some alternate mixes. Um, Alone in the studio. And that brings us up with the, the room, the room mic. Let's listen to that. Oh, so it's a nice far ambient sound. Now let's go in and, um, yeah. You know, that's what I thought that that did. I thought that's what that did. Uh, so yeah, it's, so it shifts the samples down and transposes them uh, back up. So what I want to do, let's, let's put, um, let's put one of the, um, let's put one of the close mics uh, together. Let's see. Uh, let's go to the uh, the cabinet. Let's go to the cabinet mics. I'm gonna bring just a little bit of the cabinet mics in. Let me bring up that up just a little bit more. Now let's transpose it. Um, oh, oh, it's already okay. So this is already transposed uh, six. Let's go to twelve, and let's hear what that does. And you can see the keyboard is just kind of shifting a little bit when we select different uh, transposing uh, semitones. So this has been transposed uh, down twelve semitones and then shifted back up. Um, yeah. and it gives it a darker sound. Now, what we'll do, now that's, uh, I'm gonna turn it off and do a comparison so we can hear what the difference is. Here we go, we're gonna turn this off. Now let's put it on. Yeah. It just makes it a little darker, a little more mysterious. And six is kind of a happy medium between all the way dark and, uh, and, um, and not dark at all. <laughs> so let's go to uh, dark and cold. And this is using the uh, the electric piano. We've got uh, the cabinets and a little bit of reverb there. We've got the vibrato. Let's turn the uh, speed. Um, let's go to loud keys and here. 
for that. Yeah, that's just right and right up front. That's so much fun. Okay, let's go. Uh, I love just going and seeing what uh, what we have here. Let's do some delay photocopy, and that's using the muted tone bar texture, which uh, we we're going to get into the textures here in a little bit. Oh, yeah, that's a little quirky. <laughs> and uh, signals. BF, take care. So good to see you. Oh, wow. Little sound design going on. pretty cool and again you've got this this weird dark personality here and then uh it's really cool how that uh how that's working there uh, let's go to running away well that's nice So Adrian, yeah, it, because it does feel sometimes you're listening to a Rhodes and then at other times it sounds like a Whirly. And it's... And it's very responsive. So you can hear when I dig into it, it responds. And then if you just lay very softly, it just really responds to you very nicely. Wow, very, very beautiful. Okay, now let's look at the, um, at the textures. Let's go back and look at the textures here. Um, so what we can do, and they've given us so much, so many different things that we can do inside the engine about, um, 
you know, turning all the key switches on, purging the mics that aren't used. And then we've got the velocity sensitivity here. And, and I just leave it linear. Um, and that's really cool. So let's go to some of the textures. I love having the, um, this ability to have these textures and you can blend these in. Um, it reminds me of the untamed types of things. So this is home piano untamed, I guess, a sort of. And the textures are all derived from the uh, piano sound sources. All you have to do, if you want to combine, you just hold shift and select the, another, another one of the sound sources. Let's see. Ah. Uh, oh, let's see. Okay, so I don't have the, uh, there we go. So let's go back to Apogee. we can blend the texture in. That's really nice. Okay, let's go to another texture. Um, Apollo. Let's ride it down here. That is nice. Now I'm going to turn the mix on and then shift and select um, the soft electric piano. textures have dynamic layers, it feels like. Wow. And we got to just throw, a, throw one of the pianos on there. Um. and blend the different colors. The glitchy with the beautiful, it just makes uh, makes it really fun. Joanna, um, 
Yeah, I I agree. You can you just need to do that sometimes uh, just to try Oh yes. Yeah, I see that. Yeah, thanks for reminding me, Rob. So when we go through the textures, we can see we can see that um that there's a little uh, edit and then we can go here and opens up a menu down here where we have more control over the dynamics, the velocity and mod wheel. And so we've got a little more, a little more fine control over the different, um, the different levels. So you just click on that little edit button. So now we can do texture blends and let's see. Okay, so electric piano and textures. So this is uh, coming home and this has the soft piano and then the, um, the uh, Tupelo, Tupelo texture. Yeah. Yeah, so you can just you can just go crazy. We can even go to textures and uh, select all of them, and it'll it'll pull up all of the textures. And you can go in and edit each one of those with the little edit uh, panels here. Uh, which takes it even further. Beautiful. So let's just do a Tears in the Rain. And we can see we've got all kinds of different textures selected here.
head just gets so low. Have you ever seen a house like this? <laughs> now, there's got to be a movie reference from, for that. Uh, I love uh, how Rob just throws in um, just really cool Easter eggs. so atmospheric and uh, with the textures and it takes you into uh, so many different worlds. Yeah, let's just see if we've got uh, one more thing we can take a look at. I like the delayed stuff. Um, the last resort, we've got three textures going. That's so cool. That is so cool. Let's just go back to the, um, yeah, the electric piano. Let's see. Uh, family room. It's just like you're sitting right there. Very beautiful. kinds of different oh the tape and that's got a wild Oh yeah, and there's the uh, there's the pedal. <laughs> That's fun. Okay, live studio and just listen to the space. You could just really hear how they. Rec oh, let's see, I'm gonna have to turn the um, uh, the pedals down. <laughs>
Okay, so that is a little taste of electric home piano from Westwood Instruments, another fantastic instrument. And I want to thank Rob and Adrian and the team from Westwood for uh, sending me a copy to uh, be able to share with all of you. Um, Yeah, so, right, so you can shift click and add all of them if you want. Uh, you can just keep stacking the textures up and... Um... Let's see. Beautiful. This is so cool. Yeah, you can just add until your CPU starts calling for mercy. Man, my pleasure. My pleasure, Rob. It is just my pleasure. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, it is... Um,